Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a hair tutorial to get um, soft beach waves. Um, you will need a curling wand, um, a straightener, and a brush. And then I also use um, a teasing brush to give a little extra volume, and then a hairspray for the end. So I hope you enjoy this video and I hope it helps you get the look that you're going for. Okay, let's get right into the wavy hair tutorial. So you always want to start with heat protectant. You don't want to ever put heat on unprotected hair. Always use protection. <laughs> so this is Foxy Bay and it is Cool AF Heat Protectant Spray with biotin because Lord knows I need it. So I have really thin, fine hair. Um, it doesn't really look like it right now, but I guarantee you when you see it in just like a plain ponytail, you will be able to tell. So, start by brushing your hair out all over. And then you wanna just spray this. You can protect it. Kind of in sections. Um, if you have more hair um, than I do, which you probably do, then you want to do bigger sections. Um, but since I have such fine th thin hair, like I'll show you my ponytail so you guys can understand. Ugh, that doesn't really show it, but yeah, it's super thin. Like my ponytail is very, very small. So um, with that being said, I don't have to section off my hair when I do my hair. I guess that's a perk of having thin, fine hair. So with that being said, I just go ahead and do the part that I want to do. Um, today I'm going to do a middle part. You can do the same hair tutorial um, or the same hairstyle. I'm sorry. You can do the same hairstyle with a side part too. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and do it like that. Um, and then before we begin the curl, I'm going to go ahead and add some volume with my teasing brush. Um, and I'm going to start in the back of my hair. We're going to jack it up because I need it. So teasing, back combing. So you just want to go down in one direction so you can get it back out um, without damaging the hair as much. So it's going to look a little crazy for a little bit, but we want to leave that volume in the hair um, until we're done and then we'll comb it out. My friend Logan taught me how to do this um, and it just makes such a difference. It's like so simple. You think, oh, I'm just gonna like wave my hair. But the trick at the end with the strainer is what gets those like beach waves really good. So, now that I have a little volume in the hair, I'm gonna start um, with the wand. You can use a curling iron as well and just wrap it around, wrap your hair around it without opening the clamp. So you wanna go away from the face um, up until the ear, and then you're gonna alternate. And you just wanna hold it on probably for like five seconds without going all the way up. So go down to here, wrap it around, one, two, three, four, five, and then kind of just wiggle it out a little bit. And then you'll have this super boingy, tight curl. So don't do anything with that yet. And again, just keep going around to the ear until you get to the ear and then we'll do reverse direction. And that way your hair doesn't, your hair has that tousled look. Like it's not all, the curls aren't going in the same direction. So one more piece and then I'll probably rotate and then alternate between going away from my face and then towards my face. I love wavy hair when you have like biolage like I do because it can really, it really helps show the dimension in your hair. Okay, so I'm at my ear. So now I'm gonna do this piece um, towards my face. So just switch up the angle and go towards your face. And then see how it just like this part switches so this curve goes this way. Um, and then the next piece will go away again 
And you do this all the way around your head until you get to your ear again, and then you start going away from the face. gotten to this part it looks like I have a mop on my head so you can tell that the volume already kind of went away um so now what we're gonna do is take a little bit of hairspray I love rusk um thicker um it's thickening hairspray for fine thin hair um and I do just like a little okay and then the next step would be to go ahead and have your strainer um plugged in and turned on um, so you're actually going to take the bottom pieces of each curl and straighten and it creates like the wave rather than like a full on curl. It's more of like the tousled look that everyone loves. I love it. And it helps make your hair like when you curl your hair, it obviously like starts to get a little shorter. Um, and then you can kind of just take your fingers and comb through the wave a little bit. Um, so yeah, you see how like much longer? It's so crazy actually. Like this side looks so much longer than this side, like an inch or two because I straightened the bottom here. So then you just kind of go around and do the same thing where you straighten just the ends. You don't want to straighten out the whole curl, but just the ends. this little group here I'm just kind of about like playing with it too so yeah so now that we are at this point um we want to add more hairspray to eliminate any frizz and then I'm going to go back in with my teaser brush because I need help with the volume so Just gonna go back like that. And kind of come through a little bit and lift. So yeah. And then after I do that, it's like one more spray. but you know, I think that's how the way it smells. So yeah, now you have like a tousled beach wave. Um, and it took like just a few minutes, but again, if you have more hair, it'll probably take you a little bit longer to section it off. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one.